Hey guys, it's Jason from California. Today is August 30th, 2010, Monday, and um, several of you, well, won't lie, like three or four of you, have asked me to make another update. So um, I'm going to make one, and I don't really have a plan for this because I really hadn't planned on making any updates for a little bit. Mainly because I've uh, got other crap going on in my life. I'm not going to sit here and make stories or excuses for you. I am going to, however, reference the fact that if you don't follow me on Twitter, Facebook, whatever, my blog, you really are kind of not getting the whole picture. You're just kind of getting basically whatever I decide to sit down and say to a camera, which, by the way, I'm missing my camera right now because Shanti has it. She's working on a project for Emojin Heap. <coughs> she wanted my high-quality HD amazing camera. So I'm stuck with this, which is still quite nice. But I digress. Uh, basically, I got thrown off my bike in a little bit of an accident, and I screwed up my shoulder, face, knees, and, yeah, good times. Um, still got a little bit of scarring left on my hand, and the shoulder scar is almost gone. It's like a little tiny thing now, so no big deal. Uh, <clears throat> as far as H for H is concerned, uh, a lot of, well, only one of my teammates actually has sent me a message saying, hey, where are you? What's going on? I think two, actually, maybe. No, one or two. One last week, one this week. Two different people, though. And I'm, I'm not going to be doing Hot for Halloween simply because I have some reservations about it. I'm not going to share them because it's really none of my business. However, what they're trying to do is a good thing. And all of you still participating, I highly encourage you to do it. For me, however, not me. Not for me. I'm happy that some of you joined because of me. But it's really not for me. Mainly because... I frankly just don't care that much. Uh, weight loss to me has been life for I'd say about almost three to four years now. Life. Life was weight loss, so equation mathematically life equals weight loss. And I've just, I don't know, I don't want to say I've woken up to the reality that is my world, or I don't want to say like, you know, I've had some huge revelation, because I haven't. Um, if anything, I'm still going through whatever change or revelation I'm trying to have. 28, so hopefully I'm almost out of the woods on this bullshit. But <laughs> that was for you, Shanti, if you ever watched this video. Um, yeah. Some of you a while back may remember a vlog I made about um, a personality disorder. Uh, <laughs> some of you, actually many of you did not like that vlog, you said, you know, stop me myself. Self-diagnosing, you know, um, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Uh, so I didn't talk about it ever again, but recently my brain has been driving me quite bonkers. Usually when I'm alone, not when I'm in front of people. If I'm in front of people, I usually start crying. But um, it hasn't been good lately for me. And tomorrow I'm going to go in and get tested for said personality disorder. Don't you want to talk about it? Borderline personality disorder. I want to see what they can uh, tell me about me. See if I have it, because I exhibit all the symptoms. And it's not like I'm sitting here wishing I have something, or I want to crutch to lean on saying, "Oh, I have this. This explains everything." I want to see what's going on so I can fix it, whatever it is, because it's something that hinders me that I can't even explain to you. And people that don't have anyone in their family that have bipolar or like mental like problems. I hate saying that word, but that's on the slapdash of this video. It's like <laughs> mental disorder, mental problem, whatever you want to call it. You won't get it. You don't get it. And you won't ever get it. The best I can possibly tell you to try to explain this to you is not just like a small like, oh, I'm sad today. Or, oh, the world is hard today. It's not, that's not the way it works, okay? The way it works, for me anyway, when I start to get into that mood or that mindset, there's like a huge fog in my brain. And I can't think clearly. I get really negative. And when I get really, really negative, I start feeling almost like pain or like, like a lightning bolt in my brain. And something that I just can't 
get out of. I can't just say, oh, be positive, or oh, be thankful for what you have, or oh, you know, I'm just going to sit here and say positive, 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 and that's just the way it is, and that's the way I'm going to be, and I've decided this. I can't do that. I don't have the ability to do that. I can try to do it, and it just actually makes me more negative, <laughs> actually. Um, so, for people who, I hate to use the word normal, but normal, they can do that. They can just decide to not be negative anymore. They can. It's not that hard. For me, and for many people out there, it is that hard. And when you have someone in your face telling you to get over it, to appreciate what you have, to be happy, it makes people like me angrier, more depressed, more sad. It makes me want to eat. It makes me want to give up makes me want to not care anymore. So how do you support a person like me? I don't know. What is your love language, right? What is your love language? My love language is quality time and physical touch, which none of you can help with. <laughs> quality time is quite nice. Uh, just knowing someone's there, talking to the person, not telling them to get over themselves, just to show them that you're there. That's the best you can do. Or just literally be there for the people that live here. Um, so I know my, my love language is quality time. So I try to surround myself with people as often as possible when I'm going through bad times like this. And that's what I've been doing for the past two weeks. Surrounding myself with people constantly. Constantly. Not trying to be alone. Not being alone. Focusing on myself. Focusing on happiness. And it's happened, it's happened to work very well for me. Yes, I've been getting worse. But it's almost like that's a good thing, because it's bringing it out of me. It's getting out of there, and now I can just go into t that test tomorrow and be like, look, you know, here's exactly how I feel. This is exactly the conditions I have. These are exactly the symptoms I have. I'm very aware of this. And they can help me, maybe. Hopefully. I don't know. We'll see what happens. As far as weight loss goes, though, to be frank with you, to be short, I don't care. <laughs> I genuinely just do not care right now. I care about school, life, friendships, and moving on. So... Life is not weight loss for me anymore. Life is about living. Life is about doing. And life is about loving yourself. And if I decide to finally love myself enough to exercise or to eat right, great. But because I don't, that doesn't mean I hate myself. And it does not mean that I don't respect myself. It just means that's the choice I'm making right now. So, I don't know where all that came from, but... I felt the need to talk, I felt the need to make a vlog, I felt the need to update you guys on what's going on with me. School starts tomorrow, I'm going back, I'm really excited to just go back and have some type of structure in life again. So school, work, exercise, it'll all happen eventually. And we do have some surprises, we meaning um, me, uh, Shanti, and Nicole, have a surprise for you guys, hopefully soon. So I hope you enjoy that. It's but, um, yeah. Just wanted to give you guys an update. It's not negative. It's just me. It's just me. So, if you made it this far, thank you for watching. If you're frustrated, I'm sorry, but you should know by now. My mindset is not that of just someone who is here to inspire you. My mindset is that of here to give you the truth and... You can choose to find motivation from that truth, or you can choose to be angry at that truth. But if you're choosing to be angry, you're not ready for this channel. So, I'll see you guys later. I'll make an update later, I promise.